If you use Firefox, you've probably noticed that it's much slower than Google Chrome. It's just not as responsive as Google Chrome. The problem is caused by lack of distribution of tasks among different processes. Google Chrome, for example, separates different tasks and tabs into their own separate processes. So when something goes wrong with one thing, it does not affect the rest of the things. But with Firefox, everything happens in one or two processes in the browser so when something goes wrong the rest of the things are affected. Firefox is working on something called electrolysis to solve this problem and to use electrolysis um, what I do is I use their nightly version of the Firefox. It is the experimental version that's where all the latest things are added before they go to the rest of the uh, users. So let's go to Firefox Nightlies. I will add the link to the description section so you don't have to search this. And once you download Nightly, you could also try Developer Edition. It is more stable, but the Nightly gets all the latest and greatest things. So I recommend Nightlies if you want to try it. So go ahead and download it and install like you would install any other program and the icon is going to look like this blue globe right here and it, when you double click it you're gonna see all your bookmarks and extensions and everything like nothing has changed now that you have Natalie's installed um, go ahead and in the search bar type about config about config like I did and then hit enter accept the risk and in the search bar on top not the browser ta uh, search bar but the search bar in this new tab search process count without a space process count and double click it y you should see number two or one or anything else if it's anything else just change it to eight click OK and restart the browser. Once the browser restarts um, you should you should notice a difference in the performance um, but you could also go to options under general and make sure that it says enable multi-process nightly. This needs to be enabled. Okay now that you have enabled eight processes Firefox will distribute all the load to eight different processes this will speed up everything everything will feel much faster however if one of your extensions that you use and the way you access your extensions or add-ons is by clicking the menu and clicking add-ons if any of your add-ons are not yet compatible with the multi-process then the extension will cause everything uh, it will slow down everything so to find out if your extensions are not compatible install an extension called add-on compatibility reporter I will add the link to the description section let's go ahead and add this to Firefox this is going to check and tell us if our extensions are compatible with the multi-process or not. So let's go back to add-on manager and add-on compatibility reporter is now installed and as you can see on the right side um, the blue notification says compatible with multi-process but as you can tell two of my extensions LastPass and Profile Switcher have a yellow exclamation mark that says not compatible so unless I disable this extensions the browser will actually be much slower than it used to be so there is some risk involved with enabling multi-process you have to make sure that your extensions are compatible with multi-process if they are not I do not recommend using multi-process for now you should wait until your whatever extension you're using the developer should make it compatible but if you don't see this yellow exclamation mark then that's great you can go ahead and use this as uh, your daily browser to see how it works if you experience any problems crashes 
you can click on the menu and then report site issue this will let Mozilla know that something is broken on the website if you find this helpful please leave a like button thank you for watching